Previously on The Walking Dead. No! You monsters! Garcias! Oh, you, you... You shook my goddamn guts out! No. Let's let him turn. It's only right. Joan was in on it! We did it on her orders! I'm... I'm sorry! It is too late for sorry, you backstabbing shitbag! I'll help you! I'll, I'll tell everyone in Richmond about this! We don't need your help. I'm begging you! I'd hold it there, folks. And I'd consider explaining yourselves. I asked you to get Kate and Gabe safe. Not tuck your tail and run. They were our family, David. How could you? Piece of shit! I'll give you family! Strike one. I'm out of practice, that's all. Yeah, same here. I haven't held a bat since the league booted me. Well, you got all afternoon to get back in your groove. <sighs> oh yeah. Just holding this thing makes me feel better. You doing okay? Uh, I've been wrestling with something. Hey! Hey man, you're Javier Garcia, right? The ball player? Can I get your autograph? <laughs> if you could sign my baseball, that would be so awesome. Sure thing, kid. Oh, man! Thank you! Who do I make this out to? Oh, no, no. N no names. Band player signatures are worth way more on resale than personalized crap. <laughs> Just your name is fine. D don't date it or anything. <sighs> <sighs> Hope you like it. Oh, yeah! I might get ten bucks for this! You gotta keep those fans happy, big star. Let's get back to baseball. Oh, it's out of here! Holy cow! You just had to rub it in, didn't you? Does talking like that make you feel better? Yeah, you should try it. <sighs> Son of a bitch! Strike two. Man, knock that shit off. I'm serious. You just talk, talk, talk. It's annoying. Oh, wow. Sorry, David. Look, it's cool you're trying to cheer me up. Really? I still can't believe you actually wanted to come here. If I were in your situation, I'd avoid batting cages forever. Well, thanks for bringing me anyway. I needed the distraction. Oh, Garcia's on fire! I think your ego's boosted plenty. Next time, we go to the shooting range. I don't really shoot. But I do. And I'm good at it. Ow! Fuck! You gotta 
shut up. Stupid thing. My arm's throbbing. <sighs> Maybe it's time I said goodbye. I remember I showed you how to play this game. Well, let this superstar return the favor. Watch this. Oh my god, the crowd is going wild! I got it. You don't have to rub it in my face. I'm done. David. David, what's wrong? Come back. I came here to reconnect. Instead, you just want to show me up. What's going on? David, I, I don't understand. You don't understand because you only think about yourself. And I'm sick of it. It's been that way for years. You tried to help me. Yeah, let me help you. You really want to help? All right. Drive me down to the recruitment office next week. The army? My job sucks. Kate and I fight like cats and dogs. I belong back in the army. I had a purpose there. I had respect. Hey, you know what? Yeah, do what you need to do. The army could be good for you. I was expecting more of an argument. Things between me and Kate have been going downhill for a while. But if I left, it seemed like that would be best for everyone. I can't keep pretending this is the life I want. Not anymore. I'm not gonna stand in your way. Well, all right then. I'm not gonna lie. If I go, it's gonna be hard on everyone. Kate may need help from time to time. You can help, right? You won't leave her hanging? I need to know that. I'll be there for them, since you won't. If you want to go, you should go. Thank you. I really mean it. We good? Yeah. We good. Come on. Let's get out of here. Buy your beer. Get in there. I let you go. On the road, remember? Can't you help us now? Of course I remember. It's why I haven't shot you already. That's how I'm helping you. Joan's making a huge mistake. No, you made a mistake when you murdered Lonnie. Hey, everybody just take a breath, all right? I was just trying to tell them- And that's your mistake right there. You can't fight everybody. Understand that Joan's not looking for revenge. She just wants order. Cooperation is the name of the game. There's still a way through this. I'll... I'll see what I can do. What, you're gonna choose that witch over me now? Better start leaning on your brother, Javi. He needs to get with the program. You boys want to make it out of here. Just relax and trust in the process. I brought you in. After I saved your asses. This is how you treat me. Betrayal. Lies. David, I'm not your enemy. We have to figure out what to do about Joan. Joan's betrayal wasn't as bad as yours, little brother. You have any understanding of what they're doing to me? I'm being set up. And I don't even want to think about what they'll do when they find Kate. I could have found a way to protect all of you. But now? Now you're all on your own. You gotta still have some friends here, right? I thought Lonnie was a friend. He turned on me. And you shot him. Any friends you haven't killed, haven't killed you yet. It's everyone out for themselves these days. Hey, we can still win this. You and me together should be able to take down some punk-ass soldiers. 
You are so goddamn naive, Javi. We're outnumbered here. I could be far away from here. There are other communities out there. You can't give up. Gabe didn't give up on you. And Kate? I said, what about Kate? You gave up on Kate years ago. You left us waiting while the world fell apart. She didn't forget it. Shut up! <laughs> you're dead to me. If we get out of here, you're on your own. I'm through with you. <laughs> <laughs> Typical brothers, fighting like boys. You bitch. I fucking trusted you! Careful! Don't give him a concussion. I came here to talk, not fight. You're not gonna be a problem, are you? I just want a calm discussion. I won't be a problem if you let us go. In fact, I may even be friendly. I'm sorry. I can't do that. But I like what you're trying to do. And people had concerns about me coming here after the way you murdered Lonnie, David. But I know what the real danger here is. And you need to hear about it. I think everyone in this town is dangerous. They are when they're scared and hungry. Those raids were unfortunate, but necessary. The real danger was another long winter I should have been told about this. David, you remember how many friends we lost last year. I couldn't bear to see it happen again. Tomorrow morning, I'm gonna call for a gathering in the square. The people deserve to hear a full explanation of your arrest. And then? Then you'll be replaced as head of security. No one's above the law, David. Not even you. I know the laws, Joan. You're the one breaking them. Your scheme is gonna blow up in your face. You just wait. I really hope not. I'm responsible for the lives of everyone in this community. You set me up! Everyone's gonna see through your lies! I did what I had to do to keep the people of Richmond safe. They're going to see that. And they'll also see that the biggest threat to them right now is you. Bullshit! I understand you're angry with me, but let's talk about it in private. Bring him with us. Screw this. Gotta get out of here. Useful here. Hmm. I'm not going to get up there from this bench. Could squeeze through there. No time to rest. Top of those lockers. Do those boards come loose?
Avi! Kate! I wasn't sure how I was going to find you. Then I heard the glass breaking. You're alive. For now, you escaped the guards. Barely. We gotta get you out of here. Take this. Help me pry these bars off. <clears throat> Shit. Give it a push from your side. Thanks, Kate. Now, give me a hand. What's all that noise? It's a herd. They've got this place surrounded. Come on. This way. Where are you taking me? Eleanor found a place. Gabe's there with the others. We've been hiding out there. Is Gabe all right? He'd rather be charging in to save David right now. But I convinced him to be cautious. We should probably keep moving. Where are the patrols? Oh, they're around. I had some close calls on my way to find you. Almost got caught. But I got lucky. You must be feeling better if you're sneaking around like this. I'm not, really. But I'll get my rest when we're safe. All clear. Come on. I saw them take David from the quarantine building. Yeah. How's he doing? I can't be his wife anymore. But he doesn't deserve to be locked away. He was angry. But I think he understands. I hope you're right. I still feel terrible about what's happening to him. Hold up. I think it's clear. Let's move. Okay, lead the way. before they find the room empty and sound the alarm. I think they want me more than you. If they spot us, don't be afraid to leave me behind. That's not going to happen. That's Eleanor's place. There's a lot of activity all of a sudden. I don't like this. Come on. Let's get inside.
think we should be a thing. I'm sorry. I don't know if I feel like that. That way. Hey, buddy. It's good to see you, Avi. Really? Your goofy face and everything. It's great to see you, Gabe. I didn't expect to see you again so soon. Yeah, well, things have changed. I just can't do this now. Oh, hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey, <clears throat> well, where have you been? Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? We've got to save my brother. He's still in their custody. And I'm scared what they might do to him. Told you we couldn't trust him. You were right. I want to go save my dad. Right now. He needs our help. We need a plan first. Javi. Make sure it's the way to go. Good. The last time you scrapped the plan and got yourself caught. Fair enough. So we gotta make sure we don't screw this up. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Oh. Holy shit. Javi, even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Wow. As much as I don't want to be here... You sure are glad we didn't stumble into that on our own? <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. Can you imagine? We dodged a bullet, didn't we? Yeah. I think we got luckier than I even want to think about right now. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. He's my brother, Kate. I have to. Okay. We have to rescue David. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. I can take us. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Look, Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on! Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just I don't know what to do. Just follow your heart. That's all any of us have left anymore, right? Thanks, man. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on! Good luck. Stay alert. Be careful. You'll be fine. Okay. This'll be great. We got this. Slow down, buddy. I've done this before, Avi. No, you haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? What do you mean, Avi? Just... 
Be careful. People aren't muertos. They can shoot at you. I know. Then you know to be quiet and stay hidden. So, we stay hidden and quiet? If we could just slip past quietly, it'll make our job a lot easier. Okay. We don't want to make any noise and attract any attention. Hey, I can go talk to him while you sneak inside. I'll distract him. You won't do anything to me. It's a good idea, Gabe. I, I can do this. Hey! Oh, hey. I saw something. Show me. Told you it would work. Good work, buddy. It's down here. The guns are through that door. for a key either. Have to do this the hard way. Put these in your bag. We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle nephew one two punch. Yeah, we do. Drop it. What the hell are you doing here? What are you doing with all that? Trying to help. I know you're pissed at me, but I want to do the right thing. For your brother. For him, for the rest of my family, for everyone. Yeah. It was a shit thing to do, fucking off on me like that. I know. I... Why didn't you meet me at the stronghold? We had a plan. My brother is in over his head and the water is rising. He needs our help. You're damn straight he does. But why should I trust you now? As far as I can tell, you're nothing but trouble. Yeah. We need you. A lot more than you need us, I know, but we need you. That's about the most pathetic plea I've ever heard. 
<laughs> You're lucky I've got a thing for underdogs. Okay. You know I'm in. And it looks like you could use all the help you can get. Awesome. I gotta grab something else real quick. Meet me by the front at five. Okay. You're bleeding. Are you okay? Oh my God. I'll be fine. Are you sure? I'm so sorry. Yes, I'll be fine. Don't worry about it. You have to get back to the others. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody sees him. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility's right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? Clem? <gasps> Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, <sighs> that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Thought you'd be long gone by now. <sighs> so did I. But I still need to talk about AJ with Lingard. Look at him. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. All right. Go for it. But if I lose my arm, that's on you. Ha ha. You'll be fine. I've dealt with worse. Huh. <sighs> Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. <clears throat> Clem. Are you okay? I'm fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It means you're growing up. Blossoming into your, you know, like, womanhood. Your body is, is developing, and then... Things change, but it'll be okay. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh, 
Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. Wake up! Talk to me! Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Dr. Lingard? Can you hear me? Does he look like he can hear you? <sighs> Wake up! Talk to me! <sighs> wow, that guy is really out of it. Cody? Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. No thanks. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. Just pills. Here we go. Hey, this is just what you're looking for. They help you handle it. Kate will take care of you. Think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay, hold still. Try not to breathe. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Kenny used to say I was a natural-born mother. It's a butterfly. <laughs> Goofball, want another? Which one to do next? Hmm. How about hippity hoppity? <laughs> Is that our dinner? That's a pretty good rabbit. Always used to do that one for Duck. He'd laugh his ass off. Oh, shit. Hey, grab the lighter out the duffel, will you? Just a second, goofball. Voila! Get away from him! Is he okay? Shh. Still not bitten, little guy. You know, first time I saw you holding AJ, it just looked so natural. Somewhere up there, 
His mama is looking down on you. Grateful for what you're doing. Always putting him first. She called me family. I owe it to her. You're the only mama he's got now. Protective, loving, caring. All the things a good parent needs to be, and all at your age. But parenthood is a hell of a motivator, though. <laughs> That's for sure. That kind of love. It's worth fighting for. I'm glad you didn't see what I did to Carver. But I did it for you. I know. Ooh. Kids as sick of the cold as I am. So I've been thinking. It's no use surviving out here, hoping that Wellington will take us in someday. I bet we find some good people down in Florida. Maybe even a little friend for this goofball. Wouldn't that be nice? We could use the company. Hell, I know I could. There aren't any good people anymore. If there aren't, it's because we keep losing them. Like Sarita. That day, outside house, you were just trying to save her life. I never thanked you for that. You're welcome. Life doesn't mean much without people you can relate to. Sarita always said, family is what you make it. She was right. I'm sorry for all this sappy shit. I guess I'm just... happy. All right, all right, all right. Enough sap, Kenny. <laughs> How about this one, little man? <laughs> We've got each other. As long as we have that, we'll be okay.